I want to end it on this. And and although I made a joke about you know letting him off, there there is a a massive controversy going on in our country right now with video game violence. Yes. And I don't want my joke to be perceived as right. something negative yeah. as I just did. But yeah. I, I before you got off, I wanted to talk to you about it because we talked about it on your podcast. And I'll clear it up again. I am not making light of a very bad situation in the United States. No. So I, although I hate the transition that we're doing right now right, to right. talking about yeah, this yeah. when I was telling you to you know let yeah, yeah. the verbals off, not necessarily mm-hmm. that. Right. Um as an athlete that's been that's been growing up in, 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 in a as an athlete that was in a very physical sport, not football bad. But right. very, very physical. Because yeah. you played. Hey, man, I can't touch my shoulders, man. Like, like is that really a thing? Yeah. Is that really a thing? Do that. Yeah, I can't. I, that's as far as I Come can on, go, dude. Right? Yeah. It's not because I got big biceps. <laughs> like, my arms are. These were my chicken wings. This is how I protected yeah. myself in yeah. the game. But they're all, like, fused together. Like, yeah. So, just... I'm about to trigger everybody. You played in, in, in an era where basketball was fucking. Oh, it was physical. Physical. More yeah. physical. To... We fought. Have, like, you ever, have you ever flopped? Flopped in what sense? Like, like through yourself, but but actual contact. Yeah, yeah. no, no, just no. like somebody like no swings a ball near you. No, no, no. Oh, no. <laughs> anyway, so the only reason I said we're triggering people is because everybody that yeah. watches this is like in love with like like this day and age basketball, and they say <laughs> yeah, and they say well you you Jordan played against you know uh, what is what is it plumbers and somebody else Hitch and, and Maniac are very good at just downplaying nineties basketball oh, morons right oh, like nineties basketball that's my era man yeah. It was, it was it, physical. You, the physical. It was the most physical. You, I mean, you. I, I beat people up. Yeah. Like I was an enforcer as a. If I was a hockey player, yeah. I would have been the goon. Yeah. To beat people up. Yeah. In basketball. I was an enforcer. I was a physical small forward. Yeah. That literally. Again, yeah. I laid wood on yeah. people. Yeah. Like you came across the lane. I stood you up. Yeah. Like you physically like would. I put put this into people's back. Yeah. Like it was a physical game. Yeah. And so, and so today's game, you don't, you can't touch anybody. No, yeah, there was a thing where when I was growing up playing basketball, it was like no blood, no foul. Right, right. There you no go. Blood, that's no my foul. era. Yeah, that's, that's your era, that's and that's why we, that's why we, as as spectators at the time, that now because you played basketball in a very physical era, mm-hmm. did that make you a violent person outside of basketball? Did you just no. go out and punch people no. just because you could? No, I've never, so, I've never been in a fight in my life outside of the court. Really, never. Well, I've never been on a court to yeah. get at that level. <laughs> um, so, so what is what do you think it is about these old, out of touch politicians? These these old, out of touch uh, ambassadors for whatever the fuck it is that they do. They come on the news and say it's fucking video games. That is the problem, and, and they don't have We're the easy fu- targets. The, We're the, easy the, targets. The, the thing is that they don't even have the 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 the. The, the foresight to say it is because of this video game. They just say video games in general. Yes, I was like, yeah. ah, oh shit! I, uh, you know, yeah. the, the the mass shooters mm-hmm. went out because they were playing Candy Crush. Is that yeah, what happened? Because right, exactly. that's the most played. You know, like what what do you think it is? I think it's a, I, well, definitely when it's politically used in, for an agenda, it is to dis- use to distract, mm-hmm. right? It's to distract uh, from laws that may be enacted in a, in a rapid fashion, right? Mm-hmm. So that's that's let's accuse everything else, but. You know the the, the, the gun the, the main problem, uh, and then also I think that you have a ton of uh, lobbyists that you know in other industries that lobby Washington, mm-hmm. so that in situations like this they're protected from mm-hmm. from being attacked. Right? I yeah. don't think the 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 gaming industry protects itself in that way. They don't lobby on the level that other industries mm-hmm. do. So immediately when this stuff happens, first thing that comes firing out is yeah. is it's video games. And, and and that it used to be it's movies, but and t, you know it's violence in movies. Well, look at Hollywood now; they yeah. lobby like they you don't you don't get yeah. that anymore, yeah. right? Yeah. So that's I think a huge part of it. Yeah. So you think that everybody needs to start spending some money? Well, I think if the publishers them are saying they should, they have to. I don't think because yeah. I don't agree with the the, the theory. Right. Yeah. I don't think the premise is is, yeah. a, is a flawed one. Yeah. Um. But if they if they were to, I think you would probably see. Mm-hmm. A difference in in the attack level. Yeah. Just recently, there was a lady, uh, yeah. apparently a psychologist uh, yeah. or something, oh, okay. saying that um, that they that the video games are like heroin to a kid. The addictive, the addictiveness of the heroin is at heroin levels. Okay, the addictiveness of that's video she, games. She said this: the addictiveness of heroin is. No, I'm sorry. The addictiveness of video games is like the addictiveness of heroin. heroin. Right. 
And everybody just like was like, I can't believe this. Like, even I think even one of the the news people were like, like get the fuck out of here. Like you're, you're, you know what they're addicted to. Even if there's an addictive element in there, they're addicted to competition. Yes, you're, I, I always said that's, I was. That's the same thing that got me. Yeah, that's why I play video games since I was twelve. Yeah, that's why I became a good basketball player. I'm in my gene. Yeah, what was triggered was this competitive desire to. Complete something. Yeah. Complete something. Finish something in a time frame. And like it's a challenge. It's an internal yeah. challenge. And and that's that's a huge part of it for me. And yeah. I think that's a huge part of what would drive anybody mm-hmm. to be the best at anything. Yep. If they were playing chess for hours on end, yeah. is, and that's addictive. Yep. Is that is that bad? If they're they're reading books for hours on end, is that horrible? Like it's it's anything done in, without moderation obviously is gonna be attacked. Yeah. Right? It's gonna be attacked. You can go outside and run. People, some people run for a hundred miles. I don't know. I kind of think that's healthy for the body, Mm-mm. but that's their thing. They're yeah. not even marathoners. They're ultra marathoners. Yeah. Right. So this addiction in its in its own right is, is triggers in each of us differently. Right. Mm-hmm. Some people, it's it can be food, it can be drugs, it can be video games, it can be um, like I said, running. Everyone has an, something that they will become obsessed with. Yeah. Right. Yeah. And and for some people, it's it's video games, and that's. What it is. You know? What do you think it's going to take? Because we can't wait for these people to retire. Not just so you know, well, I usually say for them to die. But right, right now I'm right. saying retire well, just because. Well, I think, I so, think so I didn't really the say beauty of, of the industry as young as it's been, mm-hmm. which is video games only been around since the 70s. Yeah. It's a young yeah. industry, right? You have a generation like myself, a father who bought video games for my son and sat down and played them with him. Yeah. Right, we rock band. My, my whole family had a rock band, Guitar Hero. You know, we had our own thing. You know, we we had our own thing. We had fun. So right? because you so guys were those playing, kids growing up, yeah, are going to have kids, and this and so more and more, you're 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 going to be talking to a generation whose lives have revolved around laptops and PCs mm-hmm. and video games and communication. It's not even going to be a thing. It's not even going to be a thing. Yeah, because you playing rock band with your family, did that make you go out and party and do drugs and live actually, that rock actually, star life? Actually, yeah. My my yeah. daughter's now my daughter's now a musician. Oh, because of rock band. Um, both of them. I wouldn't say because of rock yeah, band. Yeah, no, I know. Probably because her, her yeah, grandparents yeah. were both music teachers, and yeah, her mom yeah, yeah. was Vanessa Williams. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but but uh, no, none of that stuff uh, sends you out to to uh, conduct your life the way people are you know, yeah. suggesting that you do. I don't know. I just I, I think we'd it's, have more rock bands. Yeah, I think out it's there disgusting. Yeah. The 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 narrative that the, that these people are spinning up like out of touch, and in a world where bullshit is called out so quickly, which is called the internet, like how dare they even put themselves out there like that? There's no way that that lady went on TV, did that, and none of her grandsons and grandkids and even kids were like, "Mom, you're fucking nuts." <laughs> they probably did. You think? <laughs> Just need to give them a voice. Yeah, like <laughs> my god, man, that's crazy. Yeah.